Well, hello there, Cougars. It is Monday, September 10th, and it's homecoming week, so uh, shout out to everybody for homecoming. Got lots of stuff going on. Remember, tomorrow is the big homecoming assembly where we get to meet the homecoming court candidates. So please, please, please be on your best behavior and also be prepared to vote because everyone gets to vote for homecoming court. All right, got a special message from the dance team. They are selling bracelets. What do you guys got going on? So the dance team's selling Pure Vita bracelets, and they're six dollars each, and they're like green and gold, so they look like this. Um, we're selling them before school and at lunch Tuesday and Wednesday, and we're also selling them at the homecoming football game on Thursday. Yep. All right. <laughs> All profits go to the dance team, right? Okay. Thanks, ladies. Hello, Lainey. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. Let's do some announcements here. First of all, uh, your books are a memory that lasts a lifetime. However, the early bird prices will not. Your books are most affordable if you purchase them early. And the deadline for early bird pricing of $52 is this Friday. Purchases can be made through the Jostens website or through the bookkeeper. Don't delay. Buy today. Congratulations to the boys cross country team. They took first place at the Benton Community Invitational. Individual winner of that meet was Jacob Green. Other scorers on the team, Matt Hand, fifth place, Lucas Middlecoff, sixth, Jackson Hornet, ninth, and Jack Shizzle, twelfth. Nice job there. The JV team also took first. They were le le uh, led by Cade Bowers, fourth, Haji Ali, fifth, Gavin Smith, tenth, Cade Cunin, thirteenth, and Dylan Falk at twenty-seventh. So nice job to the boys cross-country team. Freshman gold and green volleyball teams took first and second place at the Wash Freedom Invitational this past weekend. We have two more home matches Monday and Thursday this week, so come on out and support your freshman volleyball team. There will be a girls basketball open gym on Tuesday, September 11th at 7.30 to 8.30 p.m. for all grades 9 through 12. Come on out for that. And a reminder, today is the final day to sign up a non-Kennedy guest for homecoming. If you don't meet the deadline by 3 p.m. today, you will not be able to bring that guest to homecoming. The web website you need to go to is tiny, tinyurl.com slash Kennedy homecoming. One guest per Kennedy student. No guest below grade 9. No guest maybe older than 20 on the day of the dance. Guests must be in good standing at their school. You are responsible for your guest's behavior and make sure you bring your IDs. All right, what else we got going on, Lane? All right, well, I hope you're having a fantastic Monday, first of all, and let's just get right into it. In the Casa de Espanol News, Senia Neri is, is thrilled to announce that Third Hour has won the sing-off. Felicidades, Third Hour. Band students and parents' fall fundraiser pickup begins today at 5 p.m. in the band hallway. Please have all fundraiser items picked up by 7 p.m. The cake roll and cookie dough are cake roll and cookie doughs are delivered frozen. Questions about pickup may be directed to kennedybandparents at gmail.com. The next band fundraiser will be fruit greenery in poinsettias beginning at the end of October with delivery dates around Thanksgiving. Homecoming parade forms must be turned in today by 2 p.m. in order to be in the parade. Return the forms to Mr. B in room 164 or place it in his mailbox. Juniors that are interested in retaking the pre-ACT need to sign up today with Mrs. Mead in room 252. The day of the exam is October 2nd in the ELSC, and this is an excused absence. There are no costs associated with the exam. Juniors and seniors interested in being leaders for the 2018 Fall Leadership Retreat, please go to this link. Go to this website and fill out an application. All applications are due Wednesday, September 12th. Any questions, see Ms. Mars in room 172. The link is school 2 slash leadership retreat application junior senior. Students in grades 10 through 12 who are interested in attending the Eastern Iowa College Fair in Kirkwood Community College on Wednesday, September 12th, to sign up at Mrs. Mead's room 252. The fair will feature college administration representatives from over 80 institutions in the state or surrounding areas. Space is limited, so sign up, sign up early. Students can also sign up online by visiting tinyurl.com slash mycollegevisit. Sophomores, juniors, and seniors, it's time to explore college and career options by investing in your future by participating in a one-day job shadow through the Workplace Learning Connection. Get signed up for a job shadow this year by logging into Workplace Learning Connection. Once you sign up, make sure to remind your parents to check their emails so they can e-approve the shadow. Deadline September 20th. For juniors and seniors interested in a 45 or 90 day internship, those will be open for registration September 23rd. College visits during Smart Time on, in room 126. Sign up in the counseling office Monday, September 17th for the University of Oregon in Eugene, Eugene Oregon, and Thursday, September 20th for Coe College in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. Military visits during the lunch hour in the, during lunch hour in the foyer Wednesday, September 12th will have the National Guard here. Birthdays today. Happy birthday to Elizabeth Anderson, Kayla Hare, Madeline Niemeyer, and Preston Sullivan, and to Senora Harger. Happy birthday and Feliz Cumpleaños a ti. 
activities for today. Uh, we've got boys varsity golf. They're uh, down at Brown Deer, and that's for the Valley Divisional. So good luck to our boys golf team. They are they are shooting low. So let's get some let's get some good scores there. Volleyball. We got freshmen volleyball here at home tonight, starting at five, in both uh, in the main gym. So come on out and watch our Cougars take on Xavier. Lunch menu today. You want the lunch menu? Sure. All not? right. I never get the lunch menu, but that's okay. I'm okay with that. <laughs> All right, so Station 1, we have burger basket with fries, and the same for Station 2. Station 3, salad subs, parfaits, and nachos, and hot dogs and breaded chicken. Station 4, pasta bar with breadstick. And Station 5, sweet Thai chicken rice bowl with roasted vegetables and with an alternative of cheese pizza. Well, Cougars, I hope you have a great homecoming week. Hope we have a great day today. Uh, treat each other with kindness and respect. And as always, go Cougs.